Training oil on it. That rat is too small. We need a bigger wrench for that. about living in a bus stage, tell me. Rocky, Rocky. <laughs> no, for real. Like. Well, I can't wait to have a solar panel on the top, and I like the stop sign. Okay, but the stop sign has to come off by law. Oh, shit. Yeah, you are. Okay, so what do you think, though, about having your bed on the bus, your toys on the bus, your Wii on the bus? Is that going to be cool, you think? No. Tell the world. Yeah. Oh, come on. <laughs> okay. Tell us why you're interested in doing this whole best thing. What makes you excited about it? Nothing. I think it sounds so exciting to live with you guys all the time and to be here all the time with you guys driving in a really small space. It sounds so fun to me. Yeah. I'm just really excited actually. Thank you. Okay, so I'm dressed. See? Yay! Ready to get probably just got a chest shot there, that was about it. And I'm gonna go get ready for the party. Jeez. But um, we definitely need to get a move on some things here. So I have a party though. Um, I am a rom romance specialist uh, for a major uh, adult novelty company. So I go out and I do parties for women and make them laugh, giggle, have fun, they buy some things to spice up their relationship. And being that I'm the only one working right now, I've got to get out when I can. Propane stove. Propane cooktop. Yeah, like in the bus. For the camp stove. We're not going to do one in the bus. Dude, we have a 40 foot bus. Surf bridge. Okay, so how are you figuring the scale thing? A quarter inch equals one foot. Alright, I see a problem already. What? Where's the coffee maker go? Right on top of that. Definitely. So yeah, I think I'm going to call the guy and see if we can get a hundred bucks. He'll take a hundred bucks cash for it today. Oh, you know, but definitely cool that it comes with pipe and everything. That is nice. I definitely think that will keep the bus. Absolutely. <laughs> How much does he want for it? He wants... 175 for it. I'm going to see. I don't see why it's been on there Oh for my god, we got his phone number in there. That's not good. Oh yeah. Okay. Hi, is this Lance? Yeah, hi. I'm calling about the wood burning stove you have on KSL. It, um, do you still have that? Oh, you do. Hey, um, if I brought you $100 cash today, would you be willing to take that? Yeah, okay. Um, are you going to be home today? After four. All right, great. What I'll do is um, I'll call you. I'll call you when um, I'm heading down just to make sure you guys are, that you're going to be home. All right, cool. Thank you. So I'll see you around 4, 4.30. Okay, bye. Sweet. 100 bucks. Tell me that already happened twice. Once. <laughs> Two foot by two foot closets there, and then my daughter's bed with a built-in headboard, the drawers underneath. Hey guys. Hi Dan. Hi. Are you oh, here for day two? Yeah, he's here. Is that a little blueprint going? Don't leave me. <laughs> <laughs> see you again. 
the thing is, is that then the kids get scared, but we do too, and they're like, oh, I don't know, um, but then they get excited again, so we'll have to see how it all goes, but I don't know, I hope you guys enjoy us getting everything together and tuning in and meeting our family, and um, yeah, just tune in and, and see all the updates that we have going on, and hopefully you'll follow us from start till, till finish question is, is there a finish? <laughs> is there ever going to be an end date? I don't know. I know there's an end to being here, but I mean, will there be an end to being on the road? Maybe so. All right, thanks.